Hi, I'm Kim Sine and I'm in the kitchen cooking with Suki. Today we're making gobi alu. It's a wonderful traditional Punjabi dish and what really makes it special are the spices. There's ground turmeric, which gives it that beautiful golden color. There's ground pomegranate seeds and cumin, all these rich, wonderful spices. And what's great about Suki's Home Chef collection is you've got everything you need in one little packet. So we're going to make a pretty traditional gobi alu, which is potatoes and cauliflower, and of course the spice packet, and everything you need is right there. Gobi alu. So I've got some neutral flavored oil. You can use canola oil, or um, I also like grapeseed oil, and it's a neutral flavor. And then I've got my um, the gobi alu spice mix, which I've added into here, into the oil. So you see how it's starting to froth a little bit? And that's what you want. So it gets really mixed nicely with the oil. There it is, frothing. And then you're just gonna add um, some cauliflower florets, about a cup, a cup and a half. And I've pre-cooked my potatoes a little bit. You can steam them or put them in the microwave really fast. What's so great about Suki's Home Chef collection is that you can have a meal in literally 15 minutes, as it says on the packet. And these are gluten-free as well. There are no preservatives. This is the classic Punjabi dish. As I said, look at the beautiful color. You've got the turmeric, ground pomegranate seed, cumin. So you just want to sort of combine all those flavors going to add a little bit of water just to get that going. And you, you want to also make sure it doesn't stick to the bottom of the pan. So you just, and if you steam your cauliflower and your potatoes ahead of time, it's really, really quick. Usually you don't have to add any seasoning when you're using the Suki's Home Chef Collection Spice Mix. But with this one, you do want to add a little bit of salt to taste. I'm using just a classic fleur de sel. Um, which is really wonderful. You don't need a lot of it. And then all we're gonna do is cover it and let it steam a little bit, let all the spices infuse, and it should be ready very, very soon. And then, as I said, if you just check it every so often and make sure that it's not sticking to the bottom of the pan, and if it is, no problem, just um, add a little more water and scrape it up. But it's got enough going right there. And you can add any vegetables. You can add onions. All right, so we're going to let that cook a little bit. So we're making um, our gobi alu, which is the Punjabi dish traditional of uh, just potatoes and cauliflower. We've sauteed the beautiful spice mix, sweet spice mix. And so it's not sticking to the bottom of the pan. I've added water just a little bit. As you can see, it is now ready. And I'm going to serve up our gobi alu using Suki's Complete Spice Mix. Today we've made gobi alu with Suki's Complete Spice Mix. Uh, we did a, the traditional Punjabi recipe with cauliflower and potatoes. You could add onions, you could add any vegetables you like. And I'm just going to garnish it with a lot of fresh cilantro. Of course, you can serve this over rice, you can have a little reta. Um, I love Suki's pickles and chutneys, so that would also be delicious with it. And there you have it, Suki's Home Chef Collection. Gobi Alu Complete Spice Mix.